Morning guys, just uh, do a quick vid and I suppose everyone's been talking about what everyone takes with them, you know, when they're away camping and stuff, so this is uh, my whole setup for uh, the twin, I've used this on the, this to come, basically the same setup I had on my DR650, so um, all of this stuff that's here, all that there all goes into, this is one of those third gear bags, alright, just Bonks on the back of the, you know, of the um, twin, like that. It's the same setup. I've had it on there once or twice now, but this is the same as what I was using on the DR, so. So, all of this here. So, camp chair, little two man, it's like a $20 tent. It's been bloody great actually, I've used it quite a few times now. Um, pillow, sleeping bag, it's North Queensland, we don't, it doesn't get cold up here. Uh, little ground like a picnic blanket probably the heaviest thing is a little axe come you know uh, hammer um all the cooking gears in there little stove top you know all that, all that stuff that you know we take away we've got a can of food we've got a can of steak can of food in there um full size towel uh everything's in plastic bags because it's um you know that bag's not waterproof so i just keep everything in shopping bags you know so all the bag so I'll put all this away in two seconds I'll show it a little something it's full and there you go finished product everything's in there said so $60 bloody when they're on special a uh, couple of pockets at the bottom there so I keep some of the heavier stuff um, I think the fold up chairs in one side there and then I've got um, the cooking gears in the other side and then tent sleeping gear it's all in there and the um, we rolled and that's the self-inflating mattress. We've used that a few times now. Camped it a few places with that. So, and um, I'll just whack that on the bike. Give you a look. So yeah, that's it. Sitting on the back of the bike. These things ride really well. These bags. I've actually, you know, said Korea crashed with this one last year on on the back of the DR. I think it had one strap broke. You know, which you got it lifted to hospital. So it's the same bag. It's been around, it's bloody good. It's had, yeah, it looks high, but it's just there's nothing underneath it. That, that, that's all life, so there's no real weight in it. it just looks tall when it's sitting on the bike. And I'll have um, spares. I'm going to have uh, all the rest of my wet weather gear and a few spare gloves that will go in the back of this bag here. It's just going to be lightweight stuff. Going that. That's just on a rack there, but I don't keep a lot of weight on those. I'm not a real fan of carrying too much on the back. And then. We'll have tools, fuel, and I'm going to put some um, water, a couple of bottles of water. It's going to go into the side bag there, and that's really all it is. Yeah. Well, this, actually, I might go get the scales and I'll weigh, I'll weigh this because this is the bulk of what I take. Along with other stuff there, and we'll see what it all comes out to. Back in a second. So there we are, all up. Uh, 14, just say 14 kilos in the whole bag. That's that there. And the tools and plus the pump. Oh, well, anyway, you get the idea. A couple of kilos. If you added five kilos for for bibs and bobs, another couple of kilos for the stuff, then yeah, then you you're going to get probably 15, 20 kilos tops, not including extra fuel and water. So. So with five litres of fuel and say five litres of water, you're up to, you know, 30, 40, about 40 kilos tops in the whole setup. That's on the seat, you know, and the side bags. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, yeah, that's not too bad. And that's everything for the weekend all the way. We're doing the coast to coast ride. So I might just load all this up, strap it all down and give you a quick look again. Right, and that's basically it. It's on there. It's all tied on. Just, you know, you lock these things four off at the front. Um, once you're ready to go, and that's just got spares in there. Water will go on top of that. It's just got my wet weather gear, spare gloves, spare neck warmer, and then tools, fuel, 
well, in case we need it and that'll balance hopefully balance out the bike mm, that's everything yeah uh, all set up like I said yeah oh, I said I actually prefer having a weight a bit closer it looks tall but trust me it isn't and I said this road all over the place with this set up on the DR and it, it works it works really well so um yeah a few extra straps if something breaks you got a backup strap there if you need it and so anyway guys um weekend away this is for the um we're going on the evac ride coast to coast so caramine to crumbo this weekend so there you go yeah so yeah ready to roll all right hope the bloody gives you some information anyway catch you later